Hello and welcome to my Yoga for Bin Beginners video. Today's class is a gentle introduction to yoga. I would recommend starting, if you can, with one of my guided breathing exercises and you'll find the links below. Otherwise you'll need a yoga black block and possibly a strap or a belt. Take your time and find a comfortable position lying on your back. We'll draw your right knee into the chest. Pause for a moment and then we'll start to make nice big circles with the knee, so supporting the knee on the outside. So breathing in and out just through your nose, nice big comfortable circles. So listening to your own body and listening to what feels right for you. We'll change direction. Gently warming up the hips, warming up the lower back and then we'll very gently on the end of the circle, draw the knee back into the chest. We'll take the strap and bring the strap or the belt around the widest part of your foot on the ball of your foot. We'll bend the left knee, bringing the sole of the foot onto the ground and straighten the right leg up to the ceiling. So you may have a slight bend in the knee if that feels more comfortable. We'll just pause gently, holding onto the strap having a gentle stretch on the back of the legs, nice slow breaths. Now we'll take hold of both sides of the strap in the right hand and bring the left hand onto the left hip. Take a breath in and as you exhale we'll take the leg out to the right until you feel a comfortable stretch. We don't want the leg to touch the ground, we're just gently opening out to the side, stretching on the inside of the leg around the hip. Nice slow breathing, just pausing here, but try and slow down your breath to encourage the muscles to soften and relax. Observing where you feel this stretch. Now on your next breath in, we'll bring the leg back into the center, we'll change the hands onto the strap. Now bring the right hand onto the right hip and cross the leg across the body, but without allowing the back or the hip to lift off of the ground. So really keeping your back nice and flat onto the ground. And pausing here, observing now where you feel this stretch. On your next breath in, we'll bring the foot into the center. We'll remove the strap, give the knee a good hug, and then very gently, when you're ready, lower the right leg down, straightening the leg, and then we'll draw the left knee into the chest. Give it a good hug. And then when you're ready, we're going to circle the left knee. So supporting with the, out the hand on the outside of the leg if it feels more comfortable. Now remember you can make the circles as large or as small as feels comfortable. So always listening to your own body in yoga and doing whatever feels comfortable for you. Changing direction if you haven't already. Nice slow breathing. And then we'll draw the knee into the chest, give it a hug. We'll bend to the right leg, bring the sole of the foot onto the ground. We'll take hold of the strap and bring the strap around the ball of the left foot. Encouraging the heel up towards the ceiling. Just pause here for a moment, having a gentle stretch on the back of the leg. Nice slow breathing, just observing the difference between this side and the other side. Now having the strap in the left hand, we'll take a breath in. On your exhale, we'll straighten the leg out towards the left. So observing any differences from one leg to the other. Nice slow breathing. Just pausing for one or two more breaths. Encouraging the muscles in the body to soften and to relax. On your next breath in, we'll bring the foot back into the center. We'll swap the hands onto the strap. Bring your left hand onto your left hip. And as you exhale, cross the foot across the body over to the right, but keeping the back nice and flat on the ground. Inhale, bring the leg back into the center, or remove the block, hug the knee in, or lift the other foot off the ground, hugging both knees, and gently rock from side to side, now massaging the back, massaging the hips. Nice slow breathing, or gently lower the soles of the feet onto the mat, turn completely onto your right hand side, and we'll come up and find a comfortable sitting position. So we can sit on a block or a pillow or a rolled up towel. So you may want to cross the legs or you can bring one foot in front of the other. So whatever feels comfortable. So just pause for a moment. 
Now coming into some head rotation. So we'll take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, gently lower your chin to your chest, stretching the back of the neck. On your next breath in, circle your head in one direction, lifting the chin up to the ceiling. And as you exhale, complete the circle. Nice slow breaths. Inhaling as you lift your head. And exhaling as you lower. We'll do one more in this direction. Inhaling as you lift your head. And on the end of this exhale, we'll inhale and change direction. So making the circles as large or as small as is comfortable. Inhaling as you raise your head and exhaling as you lower. And really try to keep the torso nice and still, relaxing the shoulders down the back. Do one more in this direction. And on the end of this exhale, just rest your head in its normal position in the center. Gently squeeze the shoulders up to the ears, tightening the muscles, and exhale, draw them down and back. Inhale again, squeezing up to the ears, and exhale, draw them down and back. One more, squeezing the shoulders up to the ears, and exhale, draw them down and back. We'll bring the hands to the side of the body as you inhale stretch the hands up overhead while exhale lower your left hand onto the floor and stretch over towards the left inhale when you're ready coming into the center and exhale back over to the same side inhale again lifting up and exhale again back over to the left one more, inhale, lifting up, and exhale, back over to the left. Now just pausing here, so trying to turn the torso to look up towards the ceiling. Looking under your arm, up towards the ceiling or to the sky, just pausing. Next breath in, coming up to the center, raising both arms, and we'll exhale over to the right hand side stretching, opening the left side of the torso. Inhale, gently coming up. And exhale again, back over to the same side. Inhale again, coming up. And exhale, gently stretching over to the right. Inhale, coming up. And exhale again, just pause here. So try and actively twist the torso to imagine you want to look under your arm towards the ceiling. You can either be on the elbow of your arm straight, whatever feels more comfortable. On your next breath, then we'll come to the center, raising both arms, and exhale very gently, lower down. Supporting the outside of the knees, removing the block, or we'll gently come up onto our hands and knees into tail. So the knees underneath the hips, the hands underneath the shoulders. As you inhale, we'll lower the abdomen, looking up towards the ceiling. And exhale, draw the abdomen in and up and round the upper back. Inhale again, lower the abdomen, looking up towards the ceiling. And exhale, draw the abdomen in and up and round the upper back. One more, inhale, lower the abdomen, looking up. And exhale very gently round. Well, inhale now coming into a neutral position. As you exhale, walk the hands one space forward, very gently lower all the way onto your abdomen to come into some cobras. So the hands either side of your chest, keeping your elbows in, so don't allow the elbows to fall out to the side. And now as you inhale, lift the chest and chin and exhale gently lower. Inhale again, lifting the chest and chin a little bit higher, only if it feels comfortable. And exhale, lower. One last time, inhale, lifting up to whichever height feels comfortable. And exhale, gently lower. Now as you inhale, very gently pushing back up into table. Moving everything off of the mat, we'll walk one hand and then the other way, tuck under the toes. And we'll draw the chest towards the knees, lifting the knees off of the mat to come into downward facing dog. We'll bend your left leg, straightening and stretching along the back of your right leg. 
and then we'll bend your right leg and then stretch the back of the left leg. Just pause for a moment, the first leg, and then walking out the legs when you feel comfortable. Imagine that you want to touch the heels towards the ground. So it isn't important that they touch, but we're very gently stretching in that direction. We'll walk the hands towards the feet, having a gentle bend in the knees. Cross the arms, have a gentle stretch. Inhaling and exhaling through the nose, so stretching along the whole of the back of the body. We'll rock the torso from side to side, breathing in and out through the nose. Gently release the arms or bend the knees round the back, come all the way up to standing, nice curled spine. Last thing to come up is your head and relax the shoulders down the back. Nice small circles. And take a big step with the feet nice and wide, feet parallel. And we'll bring the hands in a prayer in front of the heart. As you inhale, we'll circle the arms up overhead. And we'll exhale, bend your right knee. Imagine that you want to touch the right foot. Inhale, straighten the legs, stretch the hands up to the ceiling. And exhale, now bend the left leg. Imagine you want to touch the left foot. Inhale, straighten the legs, stretch the hands above the head. And exhale, re-bend the right knee, stretching down. Inhale, sweep the hands up overhead. Exhale one more time on the left. Imagine you want to touch the left foot. Inhale, straighten the legs, sweep the hands up to the center. And exhale back over to the right. We'll just pause here. Inhale, sweeping back up. And exhale to the left. Just pause just for a moment. And then we'll inhale, sweep up. And exhale, bring your hands onto your hips. We'll turn your right foot so it's parallel to the long side of the mat. We'll bend the right knee to come into warrior two. So the hands roughly in line with the shoulders. Looking over the middle finger of your left, of your right hand, sorry. Just pausing here, nice slow breathing. Take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, we'll gently lower the hands onto the hips and we'll straighten your right leg. We'll heel to the left foot in to come into triangle. So now drawing the hips towards the left until you feel a stretch on the inside of your right leg. Our hands roughly in line with the shoulder, stretch over to the right, lowering the right hand down as you raise your left hand. And looking up towards the ceiling or up towards your thumb if you can see. Just listening to your neck only going as deep as feels comfortable. Inhale, slowly coming back up. Exhale, bring the hands onto the hips. We'll turn the left foot out and the right foot in to come into warrior two on the other side, bending the left leg. Hands roughly in line with the shoulders. Just pause here, just for a couple of breaths. Observing any differences from the side to the other side. Inhaling, exhaling through the nose. Take one more breath in. As you exhale, we'll bring your hands onto your hips, straighten your left leg. we we'll heel to your right foot in very slightly to come into triangle. Draw the hips to the right, stretch the hands roughly in line with the shoulder, stretching over to the left. Then lower your left hand as you raise your right hand. And looking up to the ceiling or up at your thumb, if you can see, listening to your neck and what feels comfortable. Just pausing, nice slow breathing. On your next breath in, when you're ready, very gently come all the way back up. And exhale, bring your hands onto your hips, turn your feet so they're parallel, and heel to the feet together. Well, inhale, stretch the hands up towards the ceiling, and as you exhale, gently come down to sitting, so bring the hands onto the floor, taking your time, and coming and finding a comfortable sitting position. So you can sit on the block, just to help relax your hips, or on a pillow and just pause for a moment, the spine nice and tall, encouraging the shoulders down the back. And just pause and observe how you're feeling. So if you'd like to finish this practice with a guided meditation, there's a few links below. Otherwise, just sit for one or two moments, one or two breaths, observing any differences in your body. So it's always important in yoga to observe how you're feeling now. We'll bring the hands together in front of the heart and we'll finish with Namaste. Namaste. Thank you very much for your watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please leave me a comment and click the like button and also share with your family and friends. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel, Sarah Lane Therese. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.